Iowa science teacher John Cisna has gotten a lot of attention over his McDonald's diet plan. He says he lost 37 pounds and dropped his cholesterol 79 points after eating just McDonald's for 90 days. We asked a dietitian, how is that possible? Fast food can be a part of a healthy diet. She says you can lose weight on a fast food diet if you make the right choices. Keep in mind portion control and calorie levels and fitting it into your overall diet. Cisna started the weight loss project with his high school students and is making a documentary about it. His students planned his meals with a 2,000 calorie a day limit in mind. They also tried to adhere to recommended allowances for carbohydrates, protein, fat, and cholesterol. A local McDonald's owner provided the food for free. I can eat any food at McDonald's that I want as long as I'm smart with the rest of the day of what I balance it out with. He ate a lot of salads but also indulged in Big Macs. Hyde says keeping the overall calorie count down was the key to success. But there are some negatives to eating too much fast food. His diet was likely high in sodium, refined sugars, saturated fats, and even trans fats. He was probably missing out on fiber, whole grains, and heart healthy fats. Cisna's weight loss plan also included exercise, walking 45 minutes a day. He says the experiment proves it's not where you eat, but what you eat. And he plans to keep at it. He's already lost an additional eight pounds. The point behind this documentary is that, hey, it's choice. We all have choices. It's our choices that make us fat, not McDonald's.